he is counting in probability 1.34. What is the unit's digit of the sum 1 factorial plus 2 factorial plus 3 factorial all the way to 1000 factorial? So when n is greater or equal to 5, n factorial is a multiple of 5 factorial because it includes 5 factorial inside n factorial. So 5 factorial is a multiple of 10. So that means you only need to calculate the unit's digit for when n is less than 5 to find the unit's digit of the, this sum. So when 1 factorial unit's digit is 1, 2 factorial unit's digit is 2, 3 factorial unit's digit is 6, and 4 factorial unit's digit is 4. So 1 plus 2 plus 6 plus 4 is equal to 13. So the unit's digit of 13 is 3. So that means the unit digit of 1 factorial plus 2 factorial all the way to 1,000 factorial is 3. Here he is counting in probability 1.36, which integers n satisfy. Um, 1, 1 over 2 is greater than 1 over n, which is greater than 3 over 1, 100. And how many integers are there? So if you multiply this equation or this inequality by 100n, 50n is greater than 100, and which is greater than 3n. So since 50n is greater than 100, that means n is greater than 2. And since 100 is greater than 3n, that means n is less than 100 over 3. So the integers that satisfy both of these inequalities, n is greater than 2 and n is less than 100 over 3, are 3, 4, 5, all the way to 32 and 33. So the total number of integers on this list is 33 minus 3 plus 1, which is 31. Here he is counting in probability 1.38. We connect dots with toothpicks in a grid as shown in figure 1.14. This is figure 1.14. If there are 10 horizontal toothpicks in each row and 20 vertical ones in each column, how many toothpicks are there? So since there are 10 horizontal toothpicks, that means there are 11 columns of dots because if there's 1, 2, 3, all the way to 10, each one has a dot. So there's 11 columns of dots. And same reasoning, since there are 20 vertical toothpicks, that means there are 21 rows of dots. So 20, if there are 20 toothpicks in each column and there are 11 columns, that means 20 times 11, which is 220 vertical toothpicks, and the same thing to each row, 10 toothpicks in each row, and there are 21 rows, so 20, 10 times 21, which is 210, so there are 210 vertical horizontal toothpicks, so in total there is 220 plus 210, which is equal to 430 toothpicks.